Nice. <laughs> Hi guys, it's Haley. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how I do my everyday brow routine. So if you're interested, then keep on watching. Okay, so first things first, I'm going to start with my Bravo Conditioning Primer. I really love this primer because it actually has helped grow my brows. And I'm trying to get those like big, bushy, full brows. So all you do is you just do a little pump like this and you just sweep this through your brows. And it's just gonna condition them. It's gonna prep them for any product that you're wanting to put on them. If I wanted to brush my hairs upward for a feathered look, I would use it to brush them upward and so forth. But for this look, it's natural. What I use every day so as you can see, I, I'm like really sparse up here and in my arch. So when you use this twice a day in your skincare, it literally grows your brows. I call it my brow vitamins. After you prime, just brush it through to the desired direction you want your hair to go. And I just want it to go in like a natural arch. So I'm gonna leave it like this. Then you're gonna take the other side of your goof proof pencil and you're gonna see that it's like a, almost like a teardrop. And I'm just gonna kind of buff it down. This is a new one. I had just ran out of my other one, so this is pretty fresh. So I'm gonna buff it down on my hand a little bit so it's not too sharp. And I'm using the shade number five, and I'm gonna use the pointed tip and just make some hair-like strokes in the beginning of my brow, just like that. And then hair-like strokes through my whole brow. Very, very, very light hand. And I'm kind of focusing it on the top and bottom of my brow to map out that shape that I want. Make sure you get your tail just like this. Don't be afraid to spend time on your brows because you really want those natural looking hairs, even if you're drawing them on, especially for a natural brow. You don't want to look like you filled it in. No block brows, okay? <laughs> that phase is done. It's gone. We want real looking brows over here. After you do a little bit, go ahead and blend it with the spoolie, brush it through. It's just like eyeshadow. Add a little product, blend a little. This time I'm gonna brush my hairs down and you can see these negative spaces I wanna fill in. So I'm just gonna fill it in, but I'm not coloring. I'm just using the motion of the hairs in the direction that they're naturally growing. And I'm gonna brush those up and you can see that just took care of that, it filled it in. I do wanna focus this arch a little bit, so I'm gonna sharpen this tip of it a little bit, just like that. Okay, so I'm just continuing on down to my tail. I just want this filled in a little bit. I'm gonna brush those hairs up. I've been really trying to grow my brows out so I haven't waxed or trimmed them. So my hairs are a little long, so it makes it a little tricky to work with sometimes, but as long as you're taking your time and really blending out each hair stroke that you're creating, it'll all come together, I promise. Once you're satisfied with your brow, you can go ahead and highlight underneath that arch to really like heighten it. So I really like this for a natural brow. So I'm gonna go ahead and highlight the arch. I'm gonna use the High Brow Glow. This comes in two shades. It comes in the pink shade, which is like nude and it's matte, and then it comes in another pink shade, but it's more of a glow. Putting this directly under my arch, like so. And you can blend this out with your finger or a brush. Make sure it's in that tail. And then I'm actually gonna use a brush because I feel like I can get in there more and blend it out. I'm gonna brush through one more time. Perfect. Then we're gonna set it. I'm using the 24 hour brow setter. It's just a clear brow gel. It's gonna make sure that nothing's gonna go anywhere. Keep those hairs in place. And the brush isn't like, a lot of brow gels I use, have used before, they're like a mascara wand, but this is like a Rex Telcom. So it's literally brushing 
those brow hairs as opposed to just like coating a glob of gel on top. So you can really pay attention to where the hairs are going and where they're gonna stay. So I really love this one. And if you wanna add any final touches, you can. You can just go back in and add a little if you need to. And that's it. That's the final look for that natural brow. It's so easy. All I used were like a couple products. It's mainly just this Goof Proof pencil, which I highly, highly recommend you try out. It's great. And this brush and this pencil together, like the best married couple in the world, I promise you. And then you're good. This is my everyday brow routine. There are some other brow styles that I will want to show you. So stay tuned for that because they are on their way. There's about like three or four other styles that I know you're going to love. And they're really fun. Maybe I don't use them every day, but to kind of want to spice things up. So stay tuned for that, okay? Make sure you are subscribed down below. Give me a thumbs up and don't forget to hit that, you know, you hit that dab, hit that bell so you can stay notified for my next video, okay? I will see you next time. Bye, thank you for watching.